Hey guys, I'm Cameron from Fuel Tech USA, and today I'm gonna to show you our Pro 550 harness. Like all of our Pro Series harnesses, this one has the CPC connector that you can actually separate the engine harness side from the main harness side. What this allows you to do is if you ever have to service your engine or anything else like that, it makes it really easy to do that without having to remove the whole harness from the car. So you can actually unscrew it or screw it back together. It also is already terminated with our EV1 style injector connectors. It's got really nice sheathing over the whole entire harness. It has a can B connector out in the engine bay. Wastegate pressure for you turbo guys. Back pressure or pan vac. So if you're running a nitrous combination, you can use this as pan vac. Otherwise you can use it as back pressure, oil pressure, intake air temp and water temperature sensors. It already has an EGT8 connector on here with a little CPC connector. So you no longer have to wire this in yourself. TPS connector for your Ford style TPS cam and crank sensors for both two and three wire cam and crank sensors. We have our wastegate pressure and fuel pressure sensors. For the guys running low impedance injectors, we have our peak and hold jumpers, or you can actually plug a peak and hold box into here. On this one, the two step is already wired into the inside part of the harness, so you don't have to run your own wire anymore. We have our main power and ground stuff where you would actually run this to the battery and then you turn this on with your ignition switch or a switch inside the car that you can use for the main power. All of our relays and everything are already wired up with sealed relays and fuses. Drive shaft sensor is already pre-wired into this one, so you don't need to wire that yourself. You just run this to the back of the car, plug that into your drive shaft sensor and you're all set. Both CAN A and CAN B. CAN B has the Deutsch style connector for like our switch panels and other things. And this would be for um, nanos, if you want to run individual nanos per cylinder, and the ones that are not already built into the harness. You can add extra nanos or anything else that is CAN based that we sell. Also, we have our extra inputs and outputs connectors. So this one is our gray outputs for like ignition stuff, or if you want to control something by turning on ground. We've got our blue and yellow outputs on this one that are left over from the main harness that you can use. And we've also got our extra inputs connector with a sensor ground and switched power here. So that makes it really easy for you to wire any extra stuff that's not already built into this harness. Thanks guys for watching and hopefully this makes your FT550 install a little bit easier.